The Mesozoic Era, also known as the Age of the Dinosaurs, took place 215 million years ago. During the Triassic period, which is the first period of three of the Mesozoic Era, the supercontinent Pangaea slowly started to break apart and the continents started their long drift. Also during the Triassic period, large reptiles or dinosaurs first started to appear. Corals, insects, and ferns also started to form. This is the start of modern organisms. Marine life was dominant during the Triassic period, but an extinction event larger than the one that would end the dinosaurs killed almost all life on Earth and opened the door for the dinosaurs to dominate. After the Triassic period, there was the Jurassic period, and many new organisms evolved, and as well as the continents further broke apart, as is shown in the picture. This was a time of great change. Dinosaurs truly became dominant during the Jurassic. Some dinosaurs were carnivores, and others were herbivores. The Triceratops and Tyrannosaurus rex were two major dinosaurs. Also bird-like dinosaurs such as the pterodactyl formed. Mammals also became more common during the Jurassic. This is important because humans are mammals. Marsupials also became common as well. Plant life also came back in the Jurassic because of the high carbon dioxide levels. Huge rainforests like the Amazon today grew all over the world. Flowering plants also appeared during this period, which is the ancestors of things like tulips and fruits. After the Jurassic period came the Cretaceous period. The Pangaea further broke apart, and the continents were very close to where they are today. More and more complex dinosaurs formed, and lush rainforests grew even more rapidly. But all good things have to come to an end. A huge asteroid collided with the Earth in present-day Mexico. This asteroid started a chain events with co which caused an extinction to all large life on Earth. However, mammals were small and able to survive. Just like the Triassic extinction event ended the dinosaurs many years ago, a new door has opened for the mammals. In the beginning of the Triassic, there was a lack of plants, so the carbon dioxide level was high. But as the era went on, there were more plants, and the oxygen level rose greatly to near modern times by the end of, by the, end of the Cretaceous. Scientists know this from the present-day formation of the contents, top, the topography of the land, fossil fuel deposits, and fossils. For example, scientists know there was a lack of plant life in the Triassic period, because there are not many fossil fuel deposits from where that would be. Remember to check out our model, where we exhibit nymphs, which is a type of marine life, and the bronchosaurus, which is a type of dinosaur. Thank you so much for watching, and we hope you enjoyed it.